Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be sharing a step-by-step -step process for exporting and importing Conda environments across different OS platforms like Windows, Mac OS, or Linux. This is a super handy for sharing a machine learning or data science setup. So let's get started. So the first method is exporting the Conda environment. It is a platform independent way. So you can use the no builds flag to avoid OS specific build info that may break on a different platforms. So first you need to activate your environment by writing the command conda activate and then the name of your environment. And then you need to export the environment to a YAML file that is platform independent. So you can use the command conda environment export no builds and then uh, the name of your YAML file. Optionally, optionally for even more cross platform compatibility excluding the pinned versions you can export only the manually installed packages by writing the command conda list explicit and then the name of the text file uh, for example explicit env.txt the next method is importing the conda environment on another os uh, so we have like two options the first option is using the yaml file so you can create a new environment for the yaml file by writing conda environment create f and the name of the dot yml file for example environment dot yml and if the environment already exists then you need to write conda environment update f environment dot yml and uh, double dash prune so the uh, double dash prune command removes dependencies not listed in the yml file the next option is using the explicit list so it is less common but a more controlled method so you can recreate environment using an explicit spec file. So for that you need to write conda create double dash name new environment double dash file explicit underscore environment dot txt. So this one is an optional method. You can convert a YAML to requirements and it is only for pip only setups. So if you want to switch from conda to pip or work in a pure virtual environment, you can extract only the pip dependencies from the YAML. So to extract the pip only dependencies from YAML, you need to write the command grep a thousand pip environment dot yml said one d requirements dot txt. Then in a virtual environment or a pip environment, you need to type in pip install r requirements dot txt. Some good practices you should follow for cross OS compatibility. You should always use no builds in export to avoid platform specific package package builds then you should avoid pip dependencies if possible or list them in a separate requirements.txt file uh, you can use python version constraints in your yaml example you can uh, mention the version like python is equal to 3.8 to avoid version mismatches and the last practice is to stick uh, to widely available conda channels like defaults conda forge so that's it. Hope this video was helpful for exporting or importing Conda environments across different OS platforms. Uh, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next one.